The Miami Dolphins are my favorite football team because uh, my dad was always a huge Miami Dolphins fan. Uh, so growing up, and my dad would always talk about like, you know, like Dan Marino and Don Shula, who's the winningest uh, head football coach of all time. You know, the only undefeated team in the history of the NFL. So coming up, growing up, I was always a Dolphins fan because my dad was. Uh, so that's why, even though I've only ever been to Florida like twice. <laughs> Well, my favorite, my favorite song relating to just football in general, it's by Hank, Hank Williams Jr. I think it's called All My Rowdy Friends. It's the song that comes on before Monday Night Football, like the old song that came on before Monday Night Football, before all that Celine Dion garbage. Like, I don't really need scantily clad women in my football. Like, when I was younger, um, and whenever we would watch Monday Night Football, we would always, like, crank up the TV um, so Hank Williams, he would always do, like, it was the, are you ready for some football? So, that song's awesome. My favorite thing that the Dolphins have ever done, um, a lot of people, a lot of Dolphins fans would probably say, uh, the undefeated season in 1972, but I think my favorite thing was, uh, in 2008, um, going from 1 in 15, which is one of the worst records in NFL history, uh, and then a year later going 11 and 5, the, it was the greatest single season turnaround in NFL history. They went from only one win to 11 wins in just one year. Um, so that's probably my favorite uh, Dolphins moment, or like Dolphins memory in general, my favorite thing they ever did. I reached out, fell short, now you're hurt. Um, another song that reminds me of the Dolphins is uh, Too Many Words uh, by Sick Puppies. It's probably like my favorite song during the football season of 2008. And it's kind of like a, it's like a harder song. Um, it's a little bit more angry. So every, I would always work at 4 o'clock um, at Bellaria on Sunday nights. Um, so as I was driving to work after a loss, I'd be like rocking out to, uh, to Too Many Words by Sick Puppies because I like to li I like to listen to angry music when I'm angry so it worked out pretty well. When the Dolphins lose or win it pretty much like affects my whole day but when they win it's like in 2007 going just going back to that um, when we won that one game that year you would have thought that like the way my dad my brother and I were celebrating, you would have thought that we had just like won the Super Bowl or won the lottery or something. <laughs> I will always love the Dolphins. And it's really weird because being a fan of a sport, it's like the only thing that you would ever, um, it's, it's the only thing that's always constant. I would never buy a product like I would never buy a, a certain brand laptop and if it sucked I wouldn't buy that brand laptop again. Sports teams are the only thing that you kind of have like unconditional love for. No matter how bad they are, how bad they can get, um, they're, one of those, they're one of those things where you always go back to them. I have a tradition where I wear my dolphin stuff, you know, my jersey and a hat or whatever, every single Friday before a game. Um, so even in 2007, you know, when they were 0 and 7 and, and 0 and 12 uh, and all those things, I would still would wear my um, Dolphins apparel. And so, you know, no matter how many times the Dolphins disappoint me or whatever, uh, I always seem to uh, go back to them and I think I probably always will. about for Monday night.